Hello and welcome back everyone to Universe Sandbox 2, where we usually blow stuff up, but today it's gonna be different because we're gonna blow everything up. Come on. Come on, give me some success. Give me an S. Give you a U. Give me a C. Oh wait, no, don't, don't give me that. Don't give me that. Stop it. Okay, well, thankfully the game has a built-in ad ring tool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, ke I kept you all waiting to sh I wanted to do it manually, but you know wh When in doubt cheat That's that's the quote right when in when in doubt cheat No. <laughs> Aaron Aaron says no I didn't tell her anything about what we're doing here, but she seems to think that if you are doubting cheating is not okay, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go one kilometer above the surface. It's gonna be kind of close, and we're gonna put a lot of mass in. A lot of mass in. Let's turn the number of particles up to twenty thousand. Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at it! Look at that! That is actually a little bit insane. They don't really look like water though. We should have. We should have like done this, and then. And then done it. Oh my god! The amount of particles, that's a little bit laggy. Okay. Okay, fantastic. I always wanted to know what it was like to be a dead computer. Now I know. Let's just delete literally every- Did that not delete the particle? No, it didn't. For whatever reason, that, that only deleted Mars, which is the one thing I didn't want to really delete. But let's try this again. Uh... In a new simulation where we don't have tons of particles flying around to lag things up. Sphere. <gasps> Whoa, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Okay, what if we do number of particles, a ton. Number of bodies, none. Total mass, once again, we're going to bring it off a bit. A bit. A bit. A bit. Uh, how many? We're gonna do one entire moon of mass here, and then uh, we're going to do bodies instead of particles off. Mass equals parent divided by count. Sure. Color mode from material, material, water, color, blue, ring texture, nothing, and inner radius one kilometer, outer radius. Okay, th this all looks pretty good. Oh my god! Look at that! Whoa! What the actual heck have we done? Oh man, look at that! Oh my god, it's like an ocean! Just floating! Floating above the surface! You could, you could swim in each of these little particles. Wow! Look at that! That is neato! Okay, so considering that's a thing now, how about we throw it off with something? Actually, let's slowly increase the mass of Mars to convince the water to get closer. Oh, I love that pattern. That looks so neat. That, that is so interesting. Okay, ready? Okay, wait. No, I've got, I've got a plan to make this better. After we do this, I have a plan to make it even better, but let's go ahead and get the mass of Mars. Just very, very slightly increase it, and by slightly I mean quite a bit. There we go. We have increased it. How is this going to affect the... Ooh, It's not really a sphere anymore. Now it's kind of collapsing on itself. Things are getting very mathematical. It looks like something I'd have to find the volume of. Okay, very beautiful. Um, this is so interesting. Oh man, it's really falling apart at this point. It's like, look, look at the patterns. It, it's just kind of insane. Okay, so at this point, the question is, if we just keep increasing the mass, we'll just continue to go faster and faster and more. Cr oh no, they're starting to hit Mars. Oh, everything in Mars. 
Oh, the death by water. Ooh, by a lot of water too. Well, at least there's oceans now. It's okay, Mars. Thank us later. Thank us later. Does this still have what we had before? Oh, we should have saved it. Or I don't know if we can actually save it. Maybe not. Okay, let's let's try this again. That was that was so neat. That was so neat. <clears throat> okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're going to. Oh, this is gonna be kind of challenging. Uh, but we're gonna try our best. Okay, so add ring moon sphere and we're going to modify it and we're going to do 20,000 particles no bodies total mass of one earth bodies instead of particles off that on color mode from material water make sure that it's blue leave that all the same the inner radius we're gonna bring down by a lot we're gonna set it to like 378 and the outer radius we're gonna bring down a lot we're gonna set it to like a thousand there we go okay sphere bam 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 looks good will it create our dome of water Oh god, it's lagging. Why is it lagging so much? Are did they all spawn like inside of Mars? Is that the problem? Have I created like a terrible, terrible mistake here? Wow, the game is very unhappy with what I just did. I'm really not sure why. Maybe just everything is colliding at once. Oh, I think it is inside of Mars. I think that's the issue. Let, let's do a quick check. Oh god, the lag is so bad. So bad. Might as well just delete Mars. Oh my god! Ah, oh, we accidentally made a giant ball of water. Okay, if we unbo- <gasps> Whoa! Look at the shockwave! How fast is that traveling? Holy moly, we've made a ring of water. Whoa! Look at it go! Oh my god. Uh, move, moving pretty quickly, actually. Pretty quickly, not, not very close to light speed at all, but not slow. Okay, so we, we went way too close to the surface. Way too close to the surface. Um, so we're going to have to try this one last time. That was kind of neat, though. If I can't get it this time, we'll do it next time. Okay, so let's go ahead and try this. Ring, moon sphere, modify. Number of particles, 20,000. Number of bodies, zero. Total mass, one earth off from material water color blue okay so the inner radius we will so we'll try cutting that in half and cutting that in half like like i think that's gotta not be too bad okay let's pause add ring oh oh my god we did it oh look at that Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, I guess the lag is just because of the amount of particles. Oh no, it seems to just be when it's paused. Oh my god, look at it. Look at it! We've encased Mars. In a Dyson sphere of water. Oh, that's so neat. I trapped Mars in water. It would be so hard to get anything into Mars at this point. It would also be like, you know what? It would be a really good shield against like UV radiation and stuff. Depending on how 
thick this was, it could actually solve a lot of problems. It could also cause some terrible, terrible problems. Horrible, horrible problems. I mean, if you had a sphere of water, it would refract light if it hit at a certain angle, like a lens, and it would... Wait a second, no, because it's, it's convex, so it would actually... It would... One second, I need to think about this. Would it create a super, super magnified and intense point of light, or would it spread it out? If it's curved like this, yeah, because it takes a lot of sunlight and it pulls it into one point. Yeah, you'd basically create a giant magnifying glass laser that would kill anything that was in at that exact focal point, but neat. Very neat. Okay, let's try... I wish we could get even closer to Mars. But you know how we can pull that off? We don't change the mass. We lock the mass. This is kind of like the cheat. Cheat method. Because like Aaron said, cheating is the solution. Okay, so what we do is we lock the mass. <laughs> Nothing, Aaron. <laughs> We lock the mass and we increase the radius. And now we can get this very artificially close. We want it to just be like just touching the surface. This is a risky game we're playing though. There is, there's no, oh, the pole got hit. I don't know how that happened. Yikes, there goes the polar cap on Mars. Okay, so we just have to go a little bit more. A little bit more. I want to get this as close as possible without actually touching. Oh my god. Oh no, it's all touching! Ah! <laughs> oh, look at the amount of damage! Whoa! Look at the damage! Wow! I have actually never quite seen an impact like that. Ooh! Man, that is intense. And it's all water as well, so the water just rushes out from the impact sites. Wow. That is pretty insane. I, I am a, I'm a fan of what happened there. That looks so cool. So much water, but I don't think any is going to remain because the temperature is just too, too high. Yeah, all the water is gone. Wow, I want to see the scar after that. That's going to be kind of intense. Okay, and it's cooling down. It's cooling down. I could just force it to cool down. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's just get it back to a reasonable time scale. And then go to the composition or surface, surface, and maximum temperature 100. Oh, look at that. Once again, we have these neat patterns when we do these crazy collisions, but guys, that, oh, there's still water. There's still water on the surface. Even though it says it's 0%, there's like these strange patterns of water left over now. That's really odd. Well, guys, thank you all for watching. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. That was beautiful, and I will see you all next time. Peace. Hail Vuperia, discord.gg slash spookvooper if you want to talk to me and stuff and suggest next video. Exciting. Hail Vuperia, vote Vuperian. Bye.